around two years back, this place started getting, you know, more and more food trucks. There's actually not much of um, restaurants here. It's more like drive-ins. Yeah, you yeah. can just go and check. There are at, uh, around uh, five to six outlets in one single road of like what 200, 300 meters. Yeah, five to six outlets, different kinds of food actually. Welcome to one more episode from JQuest. And this time we are do gonna do a food walk right just outside the Mangal Stadium. And on the streets, you can find some amazing food trucks right just over there. So we are gonna try a few of them. So check it out. That is Mangal Stadium and just outside that you can find these amazing food trucks. Um, other day I came here for swim and I noticed like there are a lot of varieties. And I'm waiting for my friend and uh, this is called... <laughs> Hey, a foodie traveler here again. So today we are gonna uh, do a food walk and uh, explore a few of the places. Cool. So we'll start from the first one. Maybe we'll taste one item per. Uh... Or let's wait for Ajit. He'll be there. Others will be coming. Yep. In about five minutes. Yeah, sure. Let's wait for others. Okay. Till then we'll do a walk. We'll just see what's there. Stare at our camera. What he just said. Dude, you have a whole floodlight. <laughs> yeah, it's a, like a floodlight and uh, carrying a DSLR and. Uh, uh, gorilla prod with a big floodlight, like LED light actually. But this is a heavy setup, it's very heavy. <laughs> so, also, I'll mention this link in the description below so you can also check it out. It's a food truck number one, which I'm gonna try. Right now, we're doing a small walk just to you know see what's in the place. Uh, so, the first one, uh, the first shop, what was the name of the shop? Uh, yeah, there was no name, but if you it's near the circle. So their specialty, when I asked him what's the most selling, he said uh, uh, the egg roll. The second one was uh, Kudla Kitchen. Kudla Kitchen. Uh, the shop name is Kudla Kitchen and they have uh, some boti, mutton boti I guess, mutton some boti. Some boti. Yeah. And uh, right now we are walking for the third one that is just outside the Mangal Stadium uh, exit the way. That's exit way. Uh, so we are coming for the third shop. Uh, this is Sai Serum and uh, we are going to try I think uh, Pani Puri and Bel Puri. Puri, and Bail Puri. Yep. So right now we are waiting for Rajat to come. Yep. Uh, he said he'll be coming in a few minutes. Yep, and he'll have a grand entry for us. Oh uh, yeah, like we are waiting for uh, you know celebrity is a. <laughs> dude, <laughs> you know, obviously he's a celebrity dude. He is a celebrity, yeah. Dude, he's here. He's here. He's here. He is where is he? Yeah, he's here, he's here. fans. Oh my god, here comes the hero. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah. Celebrity. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, hi Rajat, nice to meet you. I'm doing great. Nice right. to meet you too. After a long time. Yeah. You know, for meeting the celebrity, we brought. What? Sorry. We got fl floodlights for you. Yeah, man. Oh, that's like this place, gully cricket. <laughs> I told like that same. Yeah, he he just said that. Uh, that we can play cricket. Cricket, yeah. So we are gonna try the places out four today. Four places, yeah. Well, Let's go. Yeah, there are four places. This is uh, yeah. This is uh, like. Uh, He'll explain better. <laughs> yeah. Well. Uh, Around two years back, this place started getting, you know, more and more food trucks. There's actually not much of um, restaurants here. It's more like drive-ins. Yeah, yeah. You can just go and check. There are uh, around uh, five to six outlets in one single road of like what 200, 300 meters. Yeah. Five okay. to six outlets, different kinds of food actually. Uh, starts with uh, eggs and bread and you know uh, vegetables. Sashang and <laughs> vegetables. <laughs> yeah, veggie boy. <laughs> veggie boy. <laughs> so then there are uh, a couple of shawarma yeah, sure. and uh, you know, yeah. the Mangalorean uh, food truck food is also. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, he makes good food. So other day I and uh, Rajat, were, after the swimming session we met and uh, we tasted that mutton soup, right? Mutton soup, yes. And, yeah, and the combination of mutton and egg. Egg. That's the first time. Yeah, I'm actually, it did go well. Go, yeah. Yeah, the, the, the creamy mutton soup. 
pan. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, one piece of small piece of mutton also. That was just two days back and we decided to like let's explore this place out. Yeah. yeah. It's this it's worth exploring. There is yeah. so many. I think we could take three whole days. And yeah. Still have more to cover. Okay. So uh, let's start. Let's do it. Let's yeah, do it. do it. And we were waiting for Rajat and uh, you know a mango fell down and no, it's getting right. It's good. It smells good. That's what nature gives you. Yeah. Not lemons this time. Mangoes. <laughs> Mangoes. <laughs> good. I and Rajat are gonna try the non veg, and uh, we have also veg, vegetarian. So he is also having, and uh, what did you order? We had uh, cucumber salad and uh, egg roll. Yeah. It comes in a roll and uh, there is chili inside. Oh, okay. Egg chili filled. And it's a roll. Oh, that's a good one. So, Wolf is uh, staring at the egg. <laughs> ah, divine. <laughs> wolf, smell something. Oh. <laughs> the wolf is smelling uh, Can you do the surgery? Like, show inside? Okay. First, we take the scalpel. Scalpel. <laughs> Cut. Open. A small hole. So we can oh. perform a keyhole surgery and this is the inside of the chicken roll. Look at this. Egg roll. Egg roll, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. Chicken, roll. chicken roll is in other bed. <laughs> so this is the egg chili. Okay. Egg chili stuffed inside the omelet and uh, let's see how it tastes. Yeah, sure. Okay. Yep. So Wolf is giving the first bite review. Thank you for giving me the honors. Yeah. <laughs> Dr. Ulf. Let me not burn my tongue, I can't feel it. <laughs> I thought you're smelling it. Ah, yeah. It smells good. Mm, it does smell good. Yeah. This is called buffering. <laughs> mm. I can actually taste. The dominating flavor of the chicken chili. I'm sorry, egg chili. Egg chili. Egg chili. Yeah, chili. <laughs> Rajat is stuck at the chicken. <laughs> uh, egg chili and um, yes, with the mild aftertaste of the omelette, um, it is actually cooked right to perfection. Yeah. And uh, is it oily according to you or non oily? No, it looks perfect. Perfect? Yes. And smells really good. And also they have served it, it in this banana leaf. Yes, a traditional way of doing it. And yeah. probably it does enhance the taste. I don't know. Yeah. This is how it looks. And uh, I'm gonna take a bite of the egg. It is not. And uh, the way they pack this egg is really good. You, you know, it's like closed. Actually, because they have, the open side is under there. Uh, yeah, we just finished the uh, first place. Uh, first food stop. That, uh, and uh, we add like uh, egg chili and uh, uh, the cucumber salad. Cook egg roll. Egg roll. Uh, yeah, egg roll egg and uh, chili. Egg, and egg roll was uh, 70 bucks, 70 rupees. And uh, the other one was 25. 25, yeah. So, going for the next second stop. I sent it to him. Okay. So, we are going to try the second uh, place today. That is, uh, what's the name of the shop? It's Kutula Kitchen. Um, and we are going to try the boti, that is mutton boti. 
first we are going to try mutton boti and yesterday we tried the mutton soup mutton soup yeah so which we spoke about earlier yeah we, which we mentioned earlier and uh, today we are not trying the same thing because we wanted to try something else mm. so uh, about yesterday i think that was uh, uh, this thing uh, yesterday was yesterday soup was really good like what what's your thought on that yeah, it was uh, uh, creamy and a uh, little bit oily you know the oil of the mutton mutton it, yeah it uh, gets into the creaminess of the soup uh, particular soup and uh, our man here anna tell it you know there sandeep he sandeep he runs the show here and uh, he said he mentioned that uh, putting an egg into the soup uh, soup yeah. does make it tastier and we did try he took his consideration and it was actually uh, pretty good good yeah uh, yes they actually cut it and then they yeah it's like it basically the small they look crush it like yes uh, cut it into not uh, tiny pieces though yeah good yeah. good uh, you know good size good uh, size uh, so that you can actually have a bite it, have a bite to feel it yeah. um, so yes it was pretty yeah. amazing and first when we said egg we were like mutton with the egg with was a question actually yeah but then it turned out to be a good choice yeah we we did <laughs> Then then Roger Wolf is tasty, uh, smelling the food wow. red meat finally <laughs> Wolf has found it So it is damn hot So Roger the wolf yes Let's go and taste it Smell has a more uh, more Indian masala type curry taste. Okay. Curry smell. What do you add to the other boaties that we had uh, earlier? Okay. It's got a very home. Do you uh, think what goes into it according to you? Yeah, there's a lot of spices in there. Uh, and apart from the beans and uh, the actual mutton boti okay yeah it's a it's a pepper pepper, okay. pepper dominated okay first bite ah first uh, i just dipped my tongue into it <laughs> yeah it's pepper definitely pepper pepper this is buffering Too good. These onions can be omitted. Forget the onions because they ruin the taste. The onion for garlic, uh, garnish. Garnishing. Mm. It does taste good. Hot, 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 hot. <laughs> I'm gonna take the. I'm gonna take the first bite. Uh, like the second bite obviously yeah and uh rajas suggested me to keep the onions away and just fry with this yeah i can smell uh, mutton here like the body actual mutton yeah. what's your take on it it's good and um spices yes but it's not uh, i'm a you know, i call it as spices mm. So I don't feel that that's so spicy, but for people who are not so tolerant for spice, maybe I think they could, uh, could give, give it a try. try yeah. And uh, they also have juices, so maybe they can substitute with juice and uh, yes, they they could. Uh, Rajat, yeah, can you guess the price of uh, what we had? Mutton boti? Yeah. Forty, fifty on spot. Forty. Forty. Yeah. Uh, then the juice. Juice ten uh, bucks on the spot here. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I am not cheating. I didn't know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so guys, uh, you didn't know that. Actually, you didn't know the price. I knew it. But yeah, Rajat uh, has been, uh, you know, price uh, make like what guessing the price. Guess the price. Yeah. Uh, what do I win? Mean? <laughs> you have to win the bill. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank nice you. play. <laughs> So yeah, I forgot to take the photo of the juice. Uh, these are the juices they have. Uh, they have cocum juice and also have a uh, lime juice. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's lime. Yeah. 
Lime, yeah. And 10 bucks worth it. Yes, what is absolutely. It? Oh, Kokum was uh, Kokum? really fresh. Yeah. And it's too not too sweet, not too bitter. Yeah. Right from the spot. So we are gonna go to the third place. No, not this. Yes, let's yes, do it. Let's go. The third stop that is Sairam, and uh, we are ordering uh, the Pani Puri. It has been long since I had Pani Puri on the street. The food has arrived. Okay. Yeah. So we ordered Pani Puri and uh, yeah. That's the Pani in the Puri. It's Pani in the Puri and it goes in the wolf's mouth. Another How many you get in a plane? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One in the mouth? Yeah, one that? in the mouth, including that. Okay, seven including. So let's sir. just dip this, give it a little bird bath and then. Mm. So that is how you eat uh, Pani Puri. Uh, take one, put in the water. Yeah, it's gonna demonstrate. Yeah. It's gonna take one. Do it again. Take it. Dip, dip it. it. Give it a little bird bath. bath. No, like it. Okay, and then take it out. Put it in the water. And that's how you eat. Mm. In local style, you just use your hand. <laughs> better. You won't better, no, but I'll, <laughs> I'll keep some for you guys. <laughs> Okay. I love the um, pani. Absolutely got enough. Um, you know this imli. Uh, it's um, imli sweet. Okay. Know? Yes, it's got that taste. Although not uh, not uh, dominating. Okay. The dominating taste is more of the the herbs in it. Pudina. Yeah. Uh, pudina, pudina. Exactly. Yeah. So let me just uh, give it to our uh, vegetarian. Vegetarian. Friend. Yep. I'm going to follow the same method. I can you you can use your hand if you have no it's okay. It's more hygienic. Why not get some more puri pani, huh? Yeah. Let's ask for some for pani. That's the best. Yeah. Bird bath again. La 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 la. <laughs> so I'm gonna take one in. This is broken, I'll take a good one. <laughs> so I'll just dip it in. Fill. Okay, so it's filled of water and here it goes. It's good. It is. One more thing I noticed was um, I have tried this more, like sweet stuff, mm. like the normal which is the sweet. Uh -huh. I think this is. I feel like this is more cleaner. Yeah, it does feel. feel yeah. yeah. There is no. Um, you don't feel like the bad. water. Yeah. The, there is no bad taste in the mouth when yeah. it comes to the water part. The water is uh, kind of. I think a bit clean. Yeah. Yeah, let's, uh, quick reviews. It is a save puri, and it looks like it needs saving. <laughs> so. I'm gonna be a hero, baby. <laughs> uh, tomorrow I get a copyright. <laughs> <laughs> Adequate amount of sweet. The tanginess is complemented by the sweet. Okay. Which gives a nice taste. Okay. And uh, the taste I can say is in the back and the front of your mouth. So you know your whole the whole of the tongue is occupied. Okay. With this particular taste. Okay. It is pretty nice. Uh, let me have some of the. And here it goes. What's the take on it? It's really good. The sweetness is just exact on point. And the save is crispy, which okay. most of the places miss that part. Mm. Mm. They okay. used old uh, save in it. This is a huge plus point. You know, they say always the last bite tastes good. So, I'm taking last bite. Save the best for the last. Yeah. I'm saving this puri. It has been waiting for me since long. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure it's not soggy yet. Yeah. Let's play the dramatic music. More like a Jurassic Park move. <laughs> music on that. <laughs> If you are going out with your friends, please have the first flight, not the last flight. It's soggy. But it's good. Yeah. The bottom is soggy, but uh, it's good. So, uh, we we just finished the third one, that is uh, just besides the fourth one. And uh, yeah, uh, right now we just arrived at the fourth one. We asked them what was the uh, most fast moving. Uh, they mentioned that Boy Chanmuri is the most fast moving. And in local, they call it a BC. 
So before it gets any soggy, take the first bite. So it's puff rice basically, puff rice with tomatoes and onions and a little bit of groundnuts. See, groundnuts. They make a good uh, combination. Combination on this particular one. A little bit of oil. It's it's not too oily. And it lemon too. Right lemon. Uh, yes, lemon has been uh, squeezed right at the beginning. So yes, coming back to the oil, it's not too oily. Uh, it's just the right uh, right amount uh, for the uh, spices to settle in. Okay. I mean the powders and everything to settle in. Uh, although there is uh, egg here, it's uh, boiled uh, charmuri, so there is egg white and the yolks as well. You can get it under underneath. You know, probably one of the other foodies can search for it. Yeah. And, and it's got a bit of mango. That burst of mango right there in your mouth. Okay. I just got that. So I'm gonna take the next bite. Yeah. I got lots of peanut. Peanut, yes. That's peanut nice. Flavor is yeah. But it um, gets get soggy fast, so you need to eat fast. That's it for today, guys. And that was a food walk uh, in the uh, exploring the uh, street food of uh, uh, just outside the Mangal Stadium. And uh, if you like this video, please do like, share and subscribe. Also do check out these videos and also do subscribe down below. And bye-bye. Uh, and uh, you know, by in case if Nat Geo or Discord is watching this video, you may not know, they may yeah. be watching this video. Do let us know, you can contact us for, uh, you know, <laughs> tasting the food of yeah, Mangalore. Yeah. So Discovery Channel and ask Nat Geo, we are, you know, we are asking you to features. Yeah, why not? Why not? We could, not? We could go on the wild also, you know, yeah. be like man versus wild or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wolf and uh, uh, wolf and uh, wild. Join quest. Yeah, yes. <laughs> yeah. We can we can go on a quest.